The manhunt continues for an armed and dangerous inmate. Authorities say killed a prison administrator. Curtis Watson escaped a Tennessee penitentiary and allegedly killed a correctional administrator. Watson is considered extremely dangerous. Brad Broders joins us live near that prison in Henning, Tennessee. And Brad, there is now a major award for his capture. What have you been able to learn from authorities? Well, Mallory, that reward is growing. It is now at more than $52,000 for the arrest and eventual conviction of Curtis Ray Watson. As you see behind me, this is one of several checkpoints within a miles long radius around that prison. Very busy today as law enforcement continues to monitor everyone who goes in and goes out of this area as this manhunt intensifies. Now, yesterday, investigators say Curtis Ray Watson killed prison administrator Deborah Johnson and took off. This afternoon, authorities said they perceived more more than 75 tips about possible Watson sightings in Tennessee and other states, but those tips haven't yet given investigators their needed breakthrough. Authorities are especially focusing on a two mile area between where they found Watson's prison work detail tractor and the home where Johnson was killed. Investigators urged those who live near the prison to be extra alert and to check anything out of the ordinary on their property. Now, those who knew the victim, Deborah Johnson, said she exemplified professionalism and that she was as strong working with those inmates and co-workers alike. Reporting live in Henning, Tennessee, Brad Broders, KARK, 4 News. Brad, thank you.